Well, I have another computer here. Um, somebody brought this uh, just probably about an hour ago. And uh, they wanted me to take a look at it. It wouldn't start up. It wouldn't um, it wouldn't boot, but it also, it, when you press the power button, basically nothing happens. So what I did, I took out the CMOS battery and uh, let it sit for oh, probably 15-20 minutes. And I also took out the laptop battery too and uh, put the CMOS battery back in, put the laptop battery back in. Uh, plugged it in and uh, it started right up. I went into the BIOS and I checked everything, uh, set everything back to defaults, and uh, then I reset the time and date. And now I'm just <clears throat> now I'm just finishing up uh, reinstalling Windows. So it seems to be working pretty good. So I think the guy is most likely going to be pretty happy with it. Uh, he said he tried everything, couldn't get it to do anything. Every once in a while it would start up, but most of the time it would just pretty much shut right down and wouldn't do a thing. So Anyway, I'm going to update the BIOS and uh, hopefully that'll maybe make it a little bit more stable. There's probably a couple of patches or fixes that they put in the new BIOS, so... Anyway, let's uh, just see what kind this is. It's a Toshiba Satellite L775D, I think, is the, the model. So anyway, I'm going to go finish this up. And I have to message him back and let him know that it's uh, done after it is actually done. Anyway, that's just another uh, quick one. And uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you uh, feel like it, uh, take a look at my channel and subscribe. And before I go, maybe I should tell you how you uh, set these things back to factory settings. So when you uh, press the power button from the off state press the power button and just as soon as you hit that start pressing the zero button that's for a Toshiba but uh, HP's, Acer's, they're all different